This is the session recap for the fourth day of September. This morning we had Jolts came out. Put that on here. This is Jolts. All right. And uh, there we go. All right. So Jolts to the downside. We're going down on dollar index. Okay. That means dollar down, which would mean euro to the upside. And of course, euro did go up, as you can see, just went up to the 618. Can't quite get to its ATR up here. That's because it's a dog. All right. So there you go. One candle, right straight up. All right. Nothing to do there. All right. Same thing on the pound here. And pound went up just a couple of pips shy of the target. That's it on that big move. That's why it has to be done with entry orders. You see why you got to deal with entry orders. All right. But you're not going to get that. So up they go. If the dollar keeps going down, look for up in here tonight. All right. Dollar Swissy validates the dollar. Sure enough, it's coming down, as you can see. And uh, came down pretty hard. Got a little bit left of the target. We're looking to come down here to, to this day chart bottom again tonight if dollar continues on down. We can go ahead now that we got an angle on here. We can go ahead and put the channel on. Heart line proven, heart line proven, heart line proven, heart line proven, heart line proven. Okay, so that's good. All right, so you're looking to come down here to, uh, well, basically 8,400 tonight. Dollar yen. We're in this trade live, doing okay. Uh, it's just sort of stalled out here. We got another trade coming in here. Our target is going to be 143.71, holding for 143.50 down here. All right. All right, so there we go. Aussie dollar. All right, Aussie dollar just took out its target just now, right there. Boom on that wick. And notice what that, see the wick? Wick, why? They exited the trade. They, they were buyers and they exited on that exhaustion wick right there. That's what you see. All right, they're done. All right. So uh, tonight, I mean, it says going up so we can get rid of this. All right. And uh, look forward to continue on up in this area right up in here, possibly all the way up to the day chart top again. All right. You know, yen, we're in this trade live right now, doing okay. And our target is down here at 159.29, holding for 159 even. Pound yen, all right, we're not in this trade, um, but we're waiting for it, all right, so watch for this tonight, especially down in this area, and remember, tonight in the Asian market, the Bank of Japan will be awake, all right, so they may actually rock and roll this thing, who knows, so have your entry orders in, be ready, all right, there we go, all right, we're looking for uh, this morning, 188.78, uh, all right, over to Aussie again, all right, Ajian, uh, real interested in this trade, especially if I get another little pullback up here, I'll be taking this trade with trade two just below this wick now for the target at the 1270 at 9636. Can't trade euro pound yet, but uh, we'd love to when it gets to it. Uh, euro Aussie went uh, right away, just missed its ATR by about 15 pips there. That's all. All right. So nothing to do. Look for it to come up into this area tonight if dollar keeps going down. All right. Swiss yen. All right. To the pip to its ATR, down to the pip, stop dead right there on its ATR. I wonder if they knew where it was. Ah, doggone it, that's Scott. He's so stinking lucky. All right, that was the day chart high yesterday. This is the day chart low today. It was predetermined by the ATR. Do I need to use the ATR? Yes, you do. All right, oh, back to that. We're watching for it to come back here and finish this off down at the bottom of the range tonight. Found Ozzy. Found Aussie coming down pretty hard here, and uh, we're at a bounce point. They did take out their ATR, all right, but we are in an up channel with MACD pointing the way down. So this could bounce and go up, or it could break out. So you're going to need to wait for it. If it bounces and go up, look for the range top tonight. If it breaks out, look for the support down here. Your New Zealand, all right, New Zealand underway to the downside. Got a little pullback here. Our target is at 7,800 down there. And we should see that continue here pretty soon. All right. Pound New Zealand, our target is down here uh, at uh, 21118. All right, it's having trouble getting going. So just keep an eye on it. I placed my entry orders for sure down here, but I, well, I this is pretty choppy up here. So you don't want to get chopped up. All right. New Zealand yen, all right. New Zealand yen on a wonder way. We've got a live trade. We're in trade two now down here, looking for 8906 down there. Aussie Swissy, and we can't trade it because we don't have a big enough ATR. Pound Swissy, all right, just missed its ATR by about six pips, it looks like, that's all. And uh, coming down pretty hard right now. Watch for it to bounce and continue on up. Right? And uh, 
because it's going the out the when the dollar went down this morning it went up so you know what it's doing it's going up so look up in this area here after you get five o'clock to get a new ATR. Finally, I was in New Zealand. We're just hanging out, not quite getting any traction at all. Our target is up here at 10891, holding for one, uh, 10900 because that's an even number right there. All righty, there we go.